So we are at David Lofter's studio this morning, as we have been for the last, I guess, 10 mornings, more or less. We would think of the lighting and we would think of the atmosphere we want in each dish and we would discuss it and then we would then proceed on shooting uh, from eight to ten recipes a day I reckon and uh, David is really really quick with his camera so uh, there is no doubt each, each picture is just, it's just amazing. And that was the first dish that we shot this morning, which was a semi-fredo. So for a semi-fredo, obviously you want to be able to see inside it, so you'd shoot it lower down. I mean, the important thing for a cookbook is always, if the person reading the cookbook doesn't understand the dish from the picture, then I've slightly failed as a photographer, really. So, so the reader has to understand the layering of that dish, has to understand you know, the different textures, everything like that. There's no point making it a bit obscure or a bit soft or, you know, it's got to be, um, you know, exactly as it would look if you follow the recipe. But it's also got to really ping off the page so that, um, you know, whoever's reading the book really wants to cook the dish and make the dish. So the food stylist has a few assistants in, in order to, you know, to cook all these, all these recipes and, and bring them together alive as if we were in a Roman kitchen, but we're in London now. And uh, Linda, who's our prop stylist, is making sure that the, all the objects that are surrounding the scene of the picture make up for the atmosphere so and this is happening in such a perfect way it is the most intriguing journey <laughs>